<laughs> Hello all, Seriously is here, back for more permadeath, and I've went ahead and gone and started a mission before I <laughs> started recording. Let's see if it works us somewhere. Uh, I had a plan, and I just grabbed a mission to tame some animals. Okay, it's not warping us, that's great, because we need to be in the system later for another part of the plan. Alright, where's this dense planet? Fauna dense planet. Yeah, that's a moon. Whatever. <laughs> uh, Alright, so the plan is, I've got several things to do. We're going to be warping for at least a couple slots here. That's the main goal right now. Uh, in between episodes, I did two things. I did some housekeeping and finding out things I needed to keep track of, like how many soon slots I have left to get. I need 46 more slots, so I need to visit 23 systems or happen across some drop pods while I'm adventuring. Hey, a minor settlement. That's part of the plan. I need to take a photo of a minor settlement. We're going to do some missions. That's part of the plan. I went through and cataloged all of my missions. I guess we can just land here. This is not a bad looking moon. What's the problem with this moon? What will be this moon's problem? I mean, it's got mushroom trees instead of nice trees, but I like the colors. Ah, malicious sentinels. That's the problem with this. I knew there'd be a problem. There's always a problem. I would have landed here if there wasn't a problem. I've been in this system before. Well, some faction. That doesn't hurt. Check for another S that I can waste. And it is. Oh, okay, I'm not going to waste this one. I have found another S-Class cabinet. Not my favorite looking gun, but I am going to mark this. And we'll do some reloading here. Not today, because it's not part of the plan. Not part of the plan. Alright, I think I have one of these on me. I do. Perfect. That'll free up a slot and mark this location. We're going to make it as gold colored as we can because it's an S-class cabinet. Uh, that will only mark for me. Hey, look at that. Uh, we don't need to uh, scan creatures this time, but we do need to scan... Let's check my chart. Three plants. Oh, hey, that's something else on me. Let's uh, scan plants on this side. And five rocks. So we can quickly do that while we're here. Let's not forget to take that photograph of this minor settlement. Got that one. Oh, there we go. That one. Not seeing too many rocks around here. We might have to uh, risk some sentinel. There's some. Oh, that's a plant. Whoops. That's a rock. That's an animal. Alright, what else do we have around here? That looks like minerals. Okay, okay. I think we almost got this. We need one more, I think. Photograph. What can we get in the background? Nothing too fancy if we want the planet, because there's nothing on that side. There's a nice sunrise, but we could uh, we could fudge it with the camera if we want to do that. Let's put the sun over there, for example. Or maybe on that side. No, let's put it back where it was-ish. We don't need a lens flare to get a nice photograph of this planet. Moon. Whatever we're on. Okay. That should have counted. Oh yeah, we're on a Nexus mission. That's why it's not going to count. So the other thing we need to put down is one of these. We need to check what bait we have. Ah, no, wrong spot. We have 
uh, not very much bait at all. Hopefully, something like sweet and compost while we make something else. Does this make enzyme fluid, I think? Yeah, well, hopefully something likes that, or we can make more sweetened compost after. That guy, I think, likes sweetened compost. Fermented fruit, of course, of course. Okay, uh, star bulb? It's not too far away. I don't know if sweet root will work. What do you like, sir? Fermented fruit as well. Alright. Well, I suspect sweet root will work because it's sweet. And that should mean it's a fruit? I don't know. I am not a chef. It does work. Excellent. So this is what we need for most of the animals here. All right, what else is on the list? I don't think we're going to get around to the travelers. I went through all of my stations that I've discovered looking for travelers to see how many we've collected. I think they disappear. I don't think they stay there forever. I only have three in all of my space stations. Um, yeah, I've definitely seen more than three in passing during the recording of these videos. Something's weird there, so... Hmm, don't know what that is. But... We've only got three, unfortunately. Scented herbs, that's what I'm making. All right, in the meantime, you, sir, can have one of these. And we'll see if that gets any of your friends to show up to feed the rest to. some scented herbs, I can go, oops, wrong button, uh, yeah, that's the right one, throw some of them up there, get three animals, oh, there's even more up here, and those are more scented herb guys, excellent, let's bring them down the hill a bit, oh, none of them got attracted to it, well, in the meantime then, let's do this. That'll help. Scare them a bit. These guys are already scared, so let's give them some food. Oh, this is more than enough. We don't even need to feed Crab Boy. What does Crab Boy eat? Sweet and compost. Okay. There we go. We're done. Part of the uh, missions to be completed, though, is to kill sentinels. So, why don't we do a little bit of that? Where was that guy? There he is. That's the wrong weapon. We need eight sentinels. Oh, and you know what? We also need creatures. We need 15 creatures, so that's one creature, and one sentinel. Three for sentinels. I've lost count on creatures already. I think I need more bull caster upgrades. This thing's getting slow. We also need to kill two predators, but I don't know that there are any on this planet. These guys are doing a pretty good amount of damage to my shields, actually. I should pay more attention. We are on permadeath. Alright, that was five sentinels. There should have been a dog with them. 
but we'll reset it so we don't get a walker. I don't see a lot of sentinels on this planet. There's a lot of creatures, though. This is definitely a fauna-dense planet. Because it's evening and they're still spawning like crazy. Hey, we might not have a lot of travelers, but we just discovered an unknown grave on our own. Uh, what system am I in? I am in... Our now. Okay, this is the system with the good... Uh, X-Class Hazard Protection Module for sale at the Scrap Merchant. So this is not a planet that has a Traveler in it, or a system, in the Space Station at least, which is good news. So this grave is not one that I'm wasting a, uh, yeah, yeah, I see. Wasting a Traveler on by grabbing first. Sentinel's deactivated. Let's grab number six. And definitely eight when his reinforcements re uh, arrive after he's dead. We still need more movement modules, even though we've got three S classes. Let's let's get some of those. Let's put that on the list. I'm gonna add that to the list right now. After these guys. Alright, that should be eight. So I can just run from the rest. Uh, another part of the plan was the very first thing I was supposed to do was spend my navigation data. I was saying I was getting sick of picking it up, but uh, you can use it for maps, and I'm not carrying any maps. So I'm gonna grab some maps when I get to a space station. I like that they can't find me in here. They watched me go into this hut. They're searching this hut very closely, but they can't locate me, but I'm not gonna waste 30 seconds in here. Okay, well, I didn't really need that carbon, but drop the word to you, okay. Let's head back to that grave. And do we see any animals? Just in case we need more rocks. No, those little mushrooms are not rocks. Okay. This will be our first glyph. Thank you for the glyph, dead traveler. All right. Let's see, any animals? Not seeing any now that it's night. So let's head away from those sentinels. And maybe back to the ship. Not sure if we completed the calling animals missions. Don't think so. Uh, some of them for sure, but not all of them. There's some animals. Maybe we'll get them all. I don't think I've even scanned this guy yet. I have not. I just knocked you into that hole. Alright, I don't see anything else. 
Wow, we traveled quite a distance from our ship. Alright, we've almost lost that Sentinel Heat, even though another one recently picked up our scent. Oh, okay, and we somehow caught more ag aggro? Okay, alright. Fine. Let's get out of here then. You guys aren't fast enough. I already got that rock, okay. And that one, and that one, and that one. I got all the rocks here. Well, probably not anywhere close to all the rocks here. I haven't been in a cave yet. Okay, anything else on the list? Well, we didn't do any travelers. We can go and visit one of them after we're done here handing this in. Let me up! Wow, it takes forever for the jetpack to recharge. Oh, can it not recharge when you have Sentinel aggro? It was red for a long time there. I'm gonna go inside, take the stairs up. Let's not forget our nutrient processor. Yeah, let's put this stuff away. And the bait as well. We don't need that clogging up our inventory. Uh, yeah, we'll keep the Mordite. We do not need that much meat. We have plenty. Let's just destroy that. Because selling it is not worth very much at all. Uh, that's something I did off camera besides going through uh, the space stations and making notes of stuff. I tried two methods of unit farming. One was to spend an hour hunting up salvageable scrap from that planet, the frost planet. I did two or three loads of my entire inventory of salvageable scrap. I made about 20 million in an hour. And then I tried to do, um, what was the second money making method I did? Oh, uh, the chlorine expansion with medium refiners. Uh, I also made about 20 million in an hour, but I only have three medium refiners. I don't have a lot of inventory space. Uh, I could definitely make more money per hour with the chlorine expansion loop than I could hunting uh, salvageable scrap on that excellent, excellent salvageable scrap planet. Uh, lots of salvageable scrap, lots of rare ones, and even the poor ones are worth not very much. Now, I'm wondering if I can find one of the huge buildings, the Galactic Archives, that will take salvageable scrap and upgrade it, if that would be more viable than the Chlorine Refiner Loop, because I don't like the Chlorine Refiner Loop. It's tedious to me. Uh, it's definitely easy. It's dead easy. Uh, spend two hours doing that, you'll definitely have 40, 50 million units. Uh, but, yeah, I don't want to spend two hours standing still. I sort of like hunting bones or, or salvageable scrap for two hours. At least I'm running around a planet and seeing stuff. All right, and the reason I took this mission was for the warp hypercore, because as I said, we need to warp places. And I just didn't want to make any fuel. Uh, I'm still going to have to make fuel, because obviously, this will not get us very far. Okay, so we have a mission to do here that I don't know what my target is. Uh, we had that minor outpost to take a photo of. Oh, we have pirates as well. Excellent. Well, they won't be a problem. But while we're here, we'll just pause it for a second. We'll go back to this. Stolen design. Take landscape photographs, but when I go to this mission, uh, if we weren't being attacked by pirates, it would tell me... Oh, uh, yeah, that it's in another system, and show me it on the map. It's one warp away, so that'll be our first warp. Oh, that's a neat-looking explorer we just blew up. Did we capture it? Yeah, look at that. Action shot. Kaboom. I don't know if 
they've improved the fire effects, but I don't remember them being that detailed. That's really neat. Anyhow, that's all we needed there. Look at all those missions we completed on that planet. That's great. Okay, so uh, let's go to that next system. We didn't get any predators. We need two predators. So if we need more creatures, those will count towards that. And this is our target system for whatever this mission is. It won't tell me what to take a photograph of. Uh, everything else that I have to take a photograph of was listed. I need two land creatures, which we can take one of. I should have gotten that where we were. Uh, I need an ancient rune. I need a volcanic plant planet, a manufacturing center, and a monolith. And whatever this one is. So, irradiated planet. Target planet located. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll return to the mission agent. Sure. But let's... Nope. Target that planet again. Uh, mission again. Stolen design. Okay. Scan planets for space. Yes. A marsh world. Now that I'm here, it's finally telling me. I have so many marsh worlds. And it forced me to come to this one. Wouldn't even tell me what planet it wanted no matter where i was in space on ground in a space station i would select this mission and it would just say target is in another system well thank you very much but at least i warped we'll get some suit slots here in a minute uh they're all over here all right hopefully it's this one that's not gonna be a marsh is it No, Bountiful shouldn't be Marsh. Marsh should only have uh, Facium. Uh, it shouldn't have four elements, just the three. Where are you hiding? There you are. That's the one. Okay, what do we have? Ooh, weird. Brown. That is very brown. Even the sky looks brown. And it's a lot further away than I expected. I thought it might be a close by moon. Oh well, we do have to hit the space station here. No, I don't want to exit pulse just to have a random pilot trade with me, thank you. Oh, that's a very red sky. Okay. Oh, and it's super mountainous. Very, look at the peaks on that. if there's any buildings nearby. How close is that trade post? An hour? That's too far away. But maybe we can get a neat picture. Since we need a picture of this planet anyway, we want to go this way and turn this way up. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, that's... come on. Alright, something like that. There we go, that should count. Let's get out of here. Did that not count? Was that not our mission? Do we have to land on the planet? Alright, well, let's go to that trade post then if we need to land on this planet. This is a really weird mission. I've never seen a photograph mission like this. Oh well, you can try and get to me before I get to the atmosphere. Good luck! Okay. If 
for a second. I thought there might be water off in the distance, but I don't think so. On a planet this mountainous, I don't expect there to be much water. Not like an ocean, at least. Although, I did see a planet recently that was half volcanic and half ocean. That was interesting. It was very mountainous on one side. Now those are some neat swampy trees. I like these. That's better than just having those tree stump ones. Yeah, these are nice. New trees. Let's see if this counts, okay. And we did just get some sort of uh, message about, uh, or music for something. Did that something just complete? There we go, stolen design, we had to land. Never seen that before in my life. We're not gonna make this jump. Oh, wow, that was close. Not that it would have killed us, but. <laughs> All right, give it to go. So we did a bunch of stuff today. We haven't touched the freighter at all, even though we did just get it. That's on the list, but I need more slots in my suit to do things like derelict freighter missions, uh, to expand the freighter. Uh, also on the list is to do a little bit of piracy, because that's going to be the fast way to upgrade our freighter to get us the matter beam, which is a huge important thing. One of the only reasons to have a freighter at all is have a matter beam on it. All right, let's go grab a suit slot and hand in a mission or 20. Uh, but we're going to do the handing him in missions off screen. So we're just going to go to the anomaly here and grab a second suit slot before I hand all of these in. Because that'll take a good 10 minutes just handing in missions, probably. Uh, there were a lot to do, a lot of kill creature missions stacked. I'm going to have to move some inventory space around because most of them weren't for nanites. They were for items. I think we got both of our scanning missions done, a lot of the photograph missions done. We still need a monolith and a manufacturing center. Those are on the list too. That's why we didn't bother looking for one right now. we got to do some manufacturing centers to spend this thingy over here. We're gonna get two more when we find one. We'll be able to get three recipes right away, hopefully. But we really wanna look into those recipes on the save because we'd like not only an Atlas Pass, but the ability to craft our own warp hyper course. It's a lot more efficient than warp cells. We could take a peek for a traveler real quick while we're here. See if we can sneak another grave. Although uh, we know what system we're in, and I know that there isn't one. But if they can disappear, they can appear, right? Uh, and that actually, no, we are in a new system. Yeah, we did have to go one short warp to get to this planet, right? What system are we in? Yeah, that's not our now. We are in a new system. We should definitely look for a traveler after we get the suit slot. So hopefully we have more than enough money now to just buy all of these. As I said, I need 40 something slots and they're less than a million each. Okay, all right. not seeing any travelers. Oh, uh, nuts, I didn't check the back room mode when I was on the other side. Okay, let's do that real quick. they can even be tending bar back here in those uh, back rooms that have a bar. See that guy? That could have been a traveler. But nothing here. Nothing doing. All right. On to the anomaly. Oh, not a bad ship. Except for its class and slots. Looks okay, though. How close can we summon in the anomaly? Right in front of the space station. Okay, so now I think we need 44 slots. So we need 
need 22 more star systems. And we can warp uh, five times per warp hypercore, or once per warp cell, unless we upgrade our hyperdrive to be not just going further, but be more efficient. So I might actually do some uh, hyperdrive upgrades on this ship after all, if only to cut down on fuel costs. Don't really need to go much further than we do. 100 light years is more than enough to get to a new star pretty much no matter where you are. Unless you go out to the fringe of the galaxy, the absolute outer edge, in which case you are definitely going to run out of stars to visit no matter how big your light year range is. And you'll have to head back towards the center. What do we got? Anything good? More piper core? No? Mm. Pirates for a couple of repair kits. Ugh. Nah, no thanks. We're out of time anyway. So until next time, everybody, have a good time.